The Commission for Science, Technology and Innovation, NACOSTI, the University of Nairobi and the United States International University Africa, USIU, have today signed a memorandum of understanding with Factor Y, a global leader in business, scaling and innovation, commercialization. The collaboration emphasizes the importance of aligning academic excellence with industry and government to accelerate the translation of research output into key growth sectors. Then, uh, Frank, I need your help here. Yeah? One of these. In the MOU signed, students with solution oriented innovations could earn as much as 12.8 million shillings upon the validation and acceptance of their ideas. FactorWise head of strategy Stefan Kali noted that the model offers a disruptive solution to different challenges, which through the transfer of intellectual property to a special purpose vehicle SPV, the company will provide global investors access with robust IP protection. We're obviously trying our best and, and uh, you know, to to be um, already at an early stage, very specific in the scoring process, so we're not creating false hopes. But then what we accept, and in addition to the 25% exit, what we mentioned, if we accept it, but the market demand could not be confirmed, the innovator gets $100,000. We believe that an exit will be around the lower end of $4 million. But again, the market will decide what it is. We're obviously aiming at higher exits. And the fact that you know we are constantly looking for solutions as far as greater levels of productivity, innovation and efficiency in all sectors. So whether it's the health sector, or the uh, manufacturing sector. With almost a billion people, local solutions have to be provided. Uh, the ideas presented will be taken through three key pillars to assess technological viability, the market and marketing strategies, and time to market, with innovators set to receive support to scale and commercialize solutions that address pressing societal challenges. We, we, we continue to see great, great creativity from our students. So this is, this is an opportunity to now turn this, the shelf things that we've had into something. And you know, for a student to try and gauge themselves, these are the parameters that get my product to the market. I think it's helping also improve our own creativity, mm -hmm. but also see it not just as creativity, but also as an income when commercialized. I think it's a wonderful opportunity. Jimmy Mbogo, Citizen TV, Nairobi.